Hello everyone, and welcome to Nakamo World of Warships. Today it's one of my replays, and I'm in the Shimakase at your 10 Japanese destroyer. Now, I'm on the map shards, and uh, yeah, there is a carrier. There is a carrier already coming in here. My Allied Fletcher, for one reason, has its anti-air on. He didn't even turn it off. He's also going straight into this camp with absolutely no exit strategy. And he is not using his smoke. Prop like, he's just smoking while going full speed ahead. Guns blazing and obviously. It's not working out so... Oh, is, is our Fletcher surviving? Nope. I have no idea what our Fletcher had planned, but I don't think there was a plan, right? Like, uh, the Fletcher did not try to slow down and disappear. It had a lot of uh, things going towards it, and it just kept going full speed, which doesn't help you with smoke. And I mean, you're sure, once you turn around, then the smoke is behind you, but... Uh, well, there we go. Meanwhile... The enemy carrier is annoying, and with the fighter plane there, I can't go into this camp. Uh, this is uh, starting to be frustrating, as usual, I guess. Now, I do have two battleships here, and at least the planes are currently attacking them. And I mean, you know, the, the rocket planes aren't going to do much against my battleships, but... Uh, Oh wait, wait, there is a there is a Johnston moving in. I'm not entirely sure why it is, I guess, because it wants to torpedo something. The enemy team they, they don't even have the camp yet. Which is shocking by itself. There is a Delny coming to flank. My battleships are probably gonna retreat here. I suppose the Johnston thought that with my battleships being so far in the bank it would just move in, but it doesn't really have the support, right? We might not be doing that well here on this camp currently, but the enemy has just two destroyers in the Chinam. So if it if like the enemy destroyer spots me, I shouldn't get devastated. And my battleships are still here. Johnson is certainly at a range where it has to fear those guns. And I mostly have to fear plane spotting and fish. I, I have to fear fish. But uh Yeah, that works. That works. <laughs> So, um, there you go. Meanwhile, if the Chinan is going to smoke in them, maybe we can top it a little bit. It's, uh, I'm not sure. It could also just turn around, go behind this island. Chinan cannot top me because there's the... Oh. Oh, hello there. <laughs> <laughs> well, we got one, did you? So, as I was saying, Chinan has no hydro. And it doesn't have torpedoes that can hit me. So, I can freely move in this area without being too afraid. I do have my own smoke screen, obviously if I'm too close and it will spot me the normal way. The guns are no joke. I mean, the guns are not very good on the Chinan, but they are more than uh, good enough to deal with the Shimakase. Because penetration won't be an issue in that case. Meanwhile, the Delny seems to be afraid to get too close, but, you know, it's probably gonna long-range torpedo there against my battleships. And I have... Like, I I could try to go into the cap, but it would be really cheeky. I don't know if the Shinani is still here, right? It's currently not shooting. Now, it's possible that the Delny isn't providing any spotting, and that's why it's not shooting, because the Delny is... I'm not sure if it has line of sight. In my, yeah, it should, right? It's shooting my battleship. So, why is the Shinan not shooting? It's inside a smoke screen, and if that we're Wisconsin is spotting, maybe it has left. Like, up you have points in that direction, right? But the Chinan could be like just heading behind this island or something. I'm still going to top this smoke, and I'm going to be careful. And once the smoke disappears, then I'm going to try. Like, it, once I see it, I might. Oh. Oh, it, it just sent down in some. Oh, okay. Well, I need my own smoke now. So the plan was to spot it once the smoke disappears and then go into the camp once it runs or if it's no longer here. Now the problem here is that Delny will likely torpedo my smoke. So I can't just keep sitting here. The Chinan in itself, right, it can't like push me with Hydro and it can't top me. 
but uh, I need to worry about Delny fish. Now, hopefully, my team is going to sink this cruiser. Yeah, my team is doing a good job, right? I do have two battleships here, and this is a very squishy cruiser. Shells are coming towards it. So now I'm going to point my nose more towards the destroyer, and... Is it gonna eat the fish? Yes, it is. Overall, I mean, keep in mind the points <laughs> is still buggy. Yeah, I mean, this bug has now been here for, what, like three months or so, so that uh, the point totals are switched. And as far as I can tell, it's only a bug in replays, not in the actual game. I mean, I'm not sure if Wargaming would care if it was a bug in the actual game, but, I mean, replays are... Anyway. Wargaming doesn't have a good track record of fixing any bugs. They usually just add more. Meanwhile, uh, we essentially have the other camps. The enemy team has no ships left and um, I will just push straight into sea here. The carrier is back to be annoying. The carrier was really annoying in at the start. Then there was a period where it left me alone, which was nice. And now I guess it's decided to be back. Meanwhile, here is the Telny, so I'm there, there is a bit of a risk here because the Telny could have talked through this gap. Of course, uh, there is a limited angle, assuming it's talked from like this part of the island. If it talked once it entered this passage, I don't know. I would assume it's trying to torpedo my battleships and not me. So there is that. Also, at this point in the game, I don't take many risks by uh, exposing myself. To its torpedoes it's like if i sink here we, we still win the game right so i don't have to worry too much is what i'm trying to say meanwhile planes are back Ooh, are my fish gonna go for the down in there yeah don't have a smoke ready but I am detected here anyway, might as well shoot. I can probably disappear behind the island if I need to, and as we've said, sinking here really isn't an issue. It's just about doing a little bit more damage before it's over. And oh, oh, I did some damage. <laughs> I did some damage and uh, I managed to get into cover, but I also stopped myself from shooting it some more. But my team might have, to oh, it's healing. Well, I'm busy maneuvering out of the position I set myself into. I'll stay here till we have the camp and then I'll run after it. And I mean, this, as we've established, there isn't really a game left. Well, there is the camp and some additional experience. And now we can see if I can get a few more points of damage from this Delany. I mean, I can send torpedoes. It's, I'm not sure. It's probably just gonna... Oh, yeah, it's dead. <laughs> Let's not overthink this. So, um, well, it wasn't the most exciting game, but if you want a good game, you need a time machine these days, and I don't have one. So this is what we've got. And uh, yeah, I hope you still enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time.